How's it going everyone? Welcome back to my Legendary Weapon Review series. The goal of this series is to go over weapons you may run into every day while exploring Destiny 2, as you may not know which weapons are better than maybe a similar weapon you picked up a day, a day before, such as which scout rifle is better than other scout rifles, or are they all just the same? I wanted to make these videos short and sweet to let you know if this weapon is worth picking up, vaulting, or just destroying for materials. I'll display the rating I gave for this weapon from the start to help you decide if this legendary weapon is a match for you, as I want to make sure you have the information you're looking for at the beginning, as you're welcome to join me for the full explanation or take the information and run, as I know you want to get back to exploring Destiny. The categories I will be going into detail explaining will be my overall weapon rating, how does it feel in active combat, does it have a strong perk pool, and can you use this weapon in high content. I will also explain where to obtain the legendary weapon, while also relating the weapon directly to this current season so you can stay up to date with current meta usage. Today's legendary weapon focus is the Nezrex Whisper Glaive. Currently this weapon is available from Banshee, which perks rotate weekly, so make sure to check in weekly for a god roll of perks you want to appear, and grab one to test for yourself. Don't forget, you can always buy 5 of this weapon, and use deep sight harmonizers to make this weapon craftable. Here's the full list of ratings I gave for this weapon to review. If you agree or disagree with my opinions, make sure to let me know in the comments below, but let's really break it down in specifics. The Nezarex Whisper is an arc adaptive frame glaive. If you're looking for a strong glaive with amazing perk combinations and god roll opportunities, definitely give this weapon a go. My recommended god roll consists of the demolition perk, which when you kill with this weapon, you generate grenade energy. Activating your grenade ability reloads this weapon from reserves, paired with Vorpal weapon, which increases damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians with their super by 15% with special weapons. The first two perks are beneficial if you can gather all four together, but they're not required. That being said, the god roll will be ballistic tuning, giving a greater increase at range, but decreasing shield duration and increasing handling speed combined with accurate rounds, which will give an additional increase to range. Combining all perks with a reload masterwork, and you have yourself a god roll ready to achieve greatness. For the Season of the Deep, the Glaives currently have an artifact effect to work disabling unstoppable targets, making Glaives almost a must-have for high-level content with increased survivability and champion use. Don't underestimate the damage a Glaive can do, as you can spam melee all day while pulling up shield whenever you need to block important damage. The combination with this season's arc-focused artifact is absolutely insane. Make sure to give arc a go with the weapon as your survivability while amplified is amazing. The Origin Trait Extrovert does a very good job of keeping you healthy and ready to continue fighting as a trait while within 15 yards of 3 enemies or a nightmare, cause your kills to restore 40 HP after a 0.25 second delay. As other glaives offer impressive traits, the overall feel in combat with the Nezrex Whisper Glaive is absolutely amazing. The only other glaive option that is Arc is the Unexpected Resurgence from Trials of Osiris, being almost an unobtainable glaive unless you really enjoy PvP. Nezrex Whisper will be recommended for use in high level nightfalls, dungeons, and lost sectors as the survivability strength of having consistent uptime, being able to assist your fire team will take you very far. Using Nezrex Whisper would be primarily for a consistent weapon that can be used for champions, stunning, as the glaive tends to be a popular choice for the seasonal artifact to control unstoppables. I would continue looking forward to being able to pull this weapon out for challenging content, where you want to rein in heavy damage spamming melees or stay alive. Whenever I want to use a glaive, I always go to a glaive that matches my subclass, and for Vark, there is no better option. I will continue to build a tier list of weapons in the same type, so you can always reference the top glaives, as for my own personal research, it's hard to find which glaives are actually the best, and which ones are just meh. If I see a large amount of feedback on the community's opinion on what the best glaive is, we'll go ahead and start our own community tier list for them. I look forward to building the tier list out for all options available. So don't sleep on the Nezrex Whisper, give it a go, let me know in the comments below what you think, don't forget to like and subscribe as I'm looking to grow my channel and broaden my horizons on what videos I can continue to make. Sub goes a long way to reach that goal. As always, I appreciate all your support and I hope you have a fantastic day.